Patch Embroidery can export SVG files for your designs for using with a digital cutter. I'm Lindy Goodall. Being able to create cutter files is useful if you have a digital cutter for precisely cutting applique fabrics and also for cutting paper or fusible vinyl to coordinate with your embroidery design. I'm in Composer here and all levels can export an SVG cutting file. Exporting cutting files works with closed shapes only. EMB files are composed of closed shapes and open shapes. To work with a stitch file, you'll need to make sure that you have your embroidery settings set to convert stitches into object files. This sheep design is an EMB file and has an applique for his body. And I want to create a cutter file for that area only. So I'll just select it by clicking on it. And then from the output design toolbox, I'll choose export cutting. Now notice it's set to export current design. I really only want to export just the body. So I'll say export selected objects only. Now when I did that, this changed down here so that I'm going to create one file and it's the applique shapes. Right now we only have SVG available to us. I can choose where I want my default location to be or I'll just use the one that Hatch selected for me which is my cutting files in the pictures directory. Hatch gives it the same name as the embroidery design but I'm going to add a template to it. That way I know that it's a cutter file. And then I'll just click export. Your SVG file is now saved and you're ready to use it in your cutter machine or cutter software, depending on your cutter requirements.